Hello Divine Feminines, welcome back to Spiritual Lux Oracle. If you are new here, thank you for your likes, your comments, your subscribes. I truly do appreciate it. The link for all of my products and services will be down below. Um, readings start at $9.99 and goes up to $111. Okay. And if you are new here, I speak only to your higher self. So let's get into this download because I keep hearing it takes 30 days to form a habit. I think it's 31. Exactly. Divine feminines, it is time. Okay, we're not going to do that whole New Year's, new me, new year resolutions. No, we're going to start now. Okay, we're going to tap into our bag now. We're going to be who we desire to be. We're going to act in our higher self we're going to be our higher version of ourselves today starting tomorrow starting tonight okay we're going to implement new morning routines we're going to implement new self-care routines new nighttime routines new manifestation routines and rituals it is time to stop putting off your blessings some of y'all have a lot of addictions that y'all need to uncover here okay and it doesn't have to be um, it doesn't have to be drugs and alcohol. It could be addicted to love, addicted to tarot, addicted to validation, addicted to um, things that do not serve you here. Okay. It's like some of you are way too focused on yeah, abandonment. It's like some of y'all are creating. Y'all are like going through the same patterns in y'all's relationships because y'all are manifesting from the same energy. It is time to shift your energy. Comment down below. I am ready to shift my energy. If you are new here, um, if you comment down below what I prompt you to, you have a chance to win money every Friday. Okay. So comment down below. I am ready to shift my energy. It's like it's time to become the highest version of yourself. Who Who is she? What does she look like? What personality does she embody? What are her um, traits? Okay what does what is her career that she's working in how much money does she make how many people does she help okay if you've been trying to manifest money <clears throat> if you've been trying to manifest money stop focusing on the number okay focus on how many people you can help here if you are still in a nine to five if you are still in a career it is hard to it's like you you reach a cap here okay so start a side hustle start a side business work on your side hustle work on your side business a lot of y'all have amazing ideas from what i can tell in the personal readings but it's like you're not you're not sacrificing you're not putting yourself first you're not focused on the desire you're not focused on the dream it's not a strong enough desire for the divine to to make things happen here yeah it's like you're being tempted by outside forces you're being tempted by um instant gratification when it's like what's going to truly make you happy is the work you put in for those long-term goals here okay i hope that makes sense and it's like it's time for you to write down it's time for you to make a vision board it is time for you to um put your plans into motion it's like a lot of us write down all these amazing ideas and then we forget about them no Okay, get that old journal out. Get that old, get them old notes back up. Okay, and affirm your desires, affirm your goals. What are your manifestation habits here? Or what are your manifestation routines? What are your manifestation rituals? Yeah, with the moon. Some of y'all are being called to do moon magic. Okay, dirt magic. Okay, I'm seeing plant magic. Get a money tree, okay? Um, we'll talk more about that in the membership because it may be a little, you know, too occult for some of you. But um, it's like even if you have a YouTube, go, like, post, 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 post. Get you, get you your goals. Read them goals every day, all day, as in present tense, okay? If your goal is to have 100,000 subscribers, read that goal <coughs> excuse me all day long i have a hundred thousand supporters i have a hundred and thousand a <laughs> hundred and thousand i have a hundred thousand youtube subscribers i have a hundred thousand blah 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 and the more emotion you attach to that sentence and it feels good and it feels um refreshing it feels amazing to know i have a hundred and thousand people who care about me who receive um transformation from my word who do this who do that okay the more information you put somebody is a makeup artist i keep picking up on a damn makeup artist um 
or a beautician, hair, makeup, skin, okay? Um, the more feeling words, the more action words that you put into your statement, into your goal, the more you will see things aligning in your life, okay? The, your job is not the why. Your job or your job is not the when. Your job is not the who or how. The job is the why, okay? Why do you want to earn a hundred thousand subscribers because i want to be able to take care of my family because i want um to help and support a hundred thousand people okay and you focus on that feeling how would it feel for you to be able to pay all of your bills and not be clocking in to your day job some of y'all are nurses and y'all are burnt the fuck out some of y'all are doctors and burnt the fuck up or <laughs> burnt the fuck out some of y'all work in the fire department because i said burnt the fuck up and y'all are burnt out some of y'all have honorable jobs but if it's not making you happy you're just satisfying everyone else around you you're just satisfying your parents okay that can brag on you but imagine how they will brag on you when you take a leap of faith and you bet on yourself and you um create your own career and you actually are able to employ other people and you're able to employ your family and you're able to build generational wealth because you took um initiative here okay you took initiative here with this hermit it's like it's time to go within it's time to cut them people that don't serve you any good off it's time to evaluate what habits you have been indulging in that is not taking you to the next level some of y'all need to get back into y'all self-care practices if you are looking yourself in the mirror every day and you are not happy about something change it who gives a fuck what people think about surgery who gives a fuck about what people think about working out okay go get healthy okay go look at the holistic route for some of you y'all are taking so many pills Y'all are taking so many pills and still have the same problems and gaining more problems. Go down a rabbit hole of what God put on this earth to heal us. There is no disease that is uncurable. Stop letting them Western society people tell you about yourself. Only you know yourself better than anybody else in this world. Okay? It's something on this earth meant to heal anything that could possibly come about is some of y'all got the jab okay and you know people are i really feel like people with the jab are getting COVID again because y'all were literally jabbed up with it so it's like learn how to cleanse your system take silver take gold take these metals that are supposed to balance back out because y'all y'all still don't know what the fuck was in that thing Okay, and they keep silencing these scientists. They keep silencing these whistleblowing doctors and these whistleblowing scientists. Like, y'all are just proving them right. Okay, so it's like, do your research. Stop watching the news. Stop watching. Um, like, stop going with the masses here. It's like, some of y'all really need to wake up. Some of y'all are about to have a third eye awakening here some of y'all are about to have a crown chakra awakening and nothing is going to be the same here nothing is going to be the same and it's like spirit is ushering us into this new world spirit is ushering us into like all of the demonic practices all of the bad um and i don't want to say entities all of everything that has been hidden is coming to light here especially surrounding health okay and it's like y'all it's just time it's just time and there's nothing outside of you that can control what your destiny is or what you have going on it's like stop letting people tell you that people been putting black magic on you no they don't have that power as soon as you give them the power that's when the magic starts okay it's like fuck all that it's you putting black magic on yourself because you it's your thought forms okay it's your thought forms wake up every day and tell yourself that you got this wake up every day and go after your dreams wake up every day and affirm and ignore your current reality and affirm your desired reality okay wake up every day and drown your subconscious mind in affirmations 
with how you want to feel or how what you want to call in here if you want to be in union with your counterpart affirm that you are already in union with your counterpart okay go through the necessary cycles go through the journey go through the healing but it's like you have more power than you think okay stop looking outside of yourself for answers stop looking outside of yourself for confirmation stop looking outside of yourself for clarity it's go within fast Okay, some of you need to fast. Some of you need to start taking herbs. Some of you need to start drinking herbal tea. Some of you need to stop smoking cigarettes. Some of you need to stop drinking wine every night to sorrow out your sorrows, okay? It's like go with and get one with yourself. All of these distractions put on this 3D realm is to stop you from getting one with yourself because the higher ups know that once you get one with yourself, you awaken you wake up others you are comfortable there's nothing that can stop you here okay and it's like for my collective for the divine feminists that i speak to you have a mission you have a purpose you have a power here okay and it's like it's time to tap into that frequency that god like frequency that allows you to manifest that allows you to bring forth all of your blessings here because if not you're going to keep watching tarot videos waiting for the next blessings to come in you're going to keep being annoyed you're going to keep being unhappy and, un and and not in alignment okay if you are still worried about money you are out of alignment if you are not happy with how you look you are out of alignment if you are still not focused on your dreams and your goals that you are out of alignment if you still don't know how things are going to happen you are out of alignment you need to have undenying unden unbelievable faith okay faith starts with a seed if you are a woman you are a womb and you create from your womb okay the more pain the more sadness that you hold into your womb that's what you are manifesting okay you will only be able to call in partners you will only be able to create more sadness in your connection the moment you switch your energy the moment you switch into your creator essence the moment you switch into your divine feminine essence and you don't let anything outside of you fuck up your vibe that's when you will start to manifest and you have to hold that energy for a while. Okay, imagine how long you've been beating the drum of of insecurity. Imagine how long, only you know how long you've been beating the drum of um, insecurity or um, not being satisfied. It's like you have to switch that energy for at least 30 days. Like, let this be the last year. Let these let this be the last few months that you are unhappy with any aspect of your life. Because next year, you have so many blessings in your vortex. You have so many blessings in your vortex, y'all. I've pulled one card. I'm all channeling. But it's like this is if you are in my collective, you are destined for a vision that you haven't even visioned yet okay it's bigger than what you could imagine it's way bigger than what you could imagine here it's like some of y'all are meant to be speakers some of y'all are meant to speak about your testimony some of y'all were hooked on hard drugs and you are still overcoming the addiction it's like some of y'all are so powerful all of y'all are so powerful but it's time to focus that power it's time to go to power school okay it's like the what you focus on will grow if you're focused on where your person is all the time if you're focused on how are you going to pay for this how are you going to pay for that that is what is going to grow if you switch your focus on to you have more than enough, okay, your person is here and acting right, okay, you are in a harmonious connection, focus on that for at least 30 days and I promise you, you will see results and you will just keep going higher and higher and higher and higher closer to your dreams. It's like overnight successes are not created overnight, but it's like once you practice that energy, once you practice that vibration, boom, you're going to go to bed in one scenario and then the next day you are in overnight success that is what is in your future here stop booking personal readings asking if you are ever going to be famous you are going to be whatever you want to be if you keep questioning you're wasting your fucking time it's time to trust your intuition you are a boss okay if you don't like how you look get in the gym if you don't like how you look if you don't like how you feel get surgery if you don't like how you look, fast. If you need answers, fast. Cut out dairy. Cut out red meat. Cut out 
fast food, cut out processed foods. Everything should be whole. Everything should be fresh. Everything should be healthy. Go to farmer's markets. Stop going to Walmart. Get fresh food. Support your local farmers. Okay, some of y'all have been eating McDonald's since y'all been kids. How the fuck do you think you're going to manifest anything if your predominant diet is McDonald's? Please tell me in the comments. You have to lift your frequency. And of course you'll be able to manifest on a McDonald's diet, but it's not going to be your your maximum potential. It's not going to be your fullest potential. Okay? Like you need to eat healthier. You need to be healthier. Stop being down on yourself about how you look. Every day my stepmom is calling herself fat and saying she needs to lose weight, but every time I tell her, "Let's take an apple cider vinegar shot. Let's let's um do some detox water." That bitch sucks her teeth. Who is going to help you if you're not ready to help yourself? And she already got all these problems and complications at 50 years old. No shade to my stepmother. I love her to death. But it's like, you are stuck in your own way for some of you. You are stuck in your own way. Get the fuck out your own way. Bulldoze those negative patterns. Bulldoze those negative habits. Bulldoze those negative thoughts. Create your own destiny. Create your new version of yourself. I'm going to be doing webinars. I think the first one is going to be for New Year's. But for the um, membership, we are going to be talking everything manifestation, candle magic, fire magic, plant magic, um, word magic, everything. You don't need anything but a piece of paper in your mouth. In a pen, maybe. Okay, so it's like, start with what you have here. So stay tuned for that membership, because a lot of you are going to need to be in it. Okay. Ace of Pentacles, y'all have so, y'all have the, y'all have high, biggest callings over your life. I'm speaking to people who are going to go down in history. I'm seeing the Hollywood Walk of Fame, or like them stars, you know. I'm speaking to people who have high callings over your life but we have free will okay we have free will you can choose to go on that path or you can choose to stay stagnant which one are you gonna choose 1717 on the timer okay so if you need a personal reading the link will be down below love you guys bye